Okay, I'll be doing number 14B. Just look there. We'll list out the, all the givens first. The final velocity equals zero, which means you're stopping. The initial velocity, which is 88 meters per second. And the time, which is 11 seconds. The acceleration, which we don't know yet. The displacement, which we have to find out, we don't know yet. After listing out, we gotta put the, write down the equation for finding out the, the acceleration, which is velocity equals initial velocity plus acceleration times, oops, times time. And then we just plug it in. The final velocity is zero equals 88 plus the acceleration times 11 seconds. And we just use simple algebra to solve this. Oops. And then we just divide by 11. And acceleration equals negative 8 meters squared. We have the acceleration now, and we just need to use the other equation to find the displacement, which is final velocity squared equals initial velocity squared plus 2 times acceleration times displacement. And then we just plug it in. Zero plus eighty-eight plus two negative eight d. And we use simple algebra again, and and we have to square eighty-eight, which is seven. 7,744 uh, plus negative 16 times D was 0. Okay. So this is 0 equals 7, 7, 4, 4 plus negative 16 times D. Simple algebra, negative 7,744 um, equals negative 16d. And just divide negative 16 on both sides. And, and then we get uh, 484 meters. And that's it.